A fraction represents a part of a whole or a part of a set. Every fraction has a numerator and a denominator. The numerator stands for the number of parts being considered. The denominator stands for the number of equal parts that make up the whole. This pie is divided into 12 equal parts. Marcel and his friend each ate three pieces of pie. What fraction of the pie did the two boys eat? The denominator is the total number of pieces that make up the pie, 12. Again, the numerator is the number of parts being considered. In this case, the numerator is 6. Since each of the two boys ate three pieces of pie, the boys ate 6 twelfths, or one half of the pie. One half of this pizza is highlighted. One third of this pizza is highlighted. One fourth of this pizza is highlighted. What do you notice? As the denominator gets bigger, it represents a smaller part of the pizza. One half of an object is a bigger portion than one fourth of the same object. Think of the horizontal line between the numerator and denominator as the words out of. For instance, this fraction means 1 out of 2. This fraction means 3 out of 4. This fraction means 7 out of 8. A great way to compare fractions is by using fraction strips. Is 2 thirds greater than, less than, or equal to 1 fourth? 2 thirds is greater than 1 fourth. Which is greater, 1 half or 2 fourths? 1 half and 2 fourths are equal, so they are called equivalent fractions. Fraction strips can also help you put fractions in order. List these fractions from least to greatest. 3 fourths, 2 fifths, 3 tenths, and 3 eighths. The fraction with the least value is 3 tenths. 3 eighths is slightly greater than 3 tenths. 2 fifths has a value greater than both 3 tenths and 3 eighths. 3 fourths is greater than all three fractions. The fractions ordered from least to greatest are 3 tenths, 3 eighths, 2 fifths, and 3 fourths. You can reduce a fraction to its simplest form by finding the greatest common factor of the numerator and the denominator. Common factors of two numbers are factors that are the same for both numbers. The greatest common factor of two numbers is the largest number that is a factor of both. What is the simplest form of 18 24 First, find the factors of the two numbers. Then, look for the common factors. 1, 2, 3, and 6 are common factors of 18 and 24. The greatest common factor is 6. Divide both the numerator and the denominator of the fraction 18 24 by 6. 18 divided by 6 equals 3. 24 divided by 6 equals 4. The simplest form of 18 24 is 3 fourths. A mixed number is a number that includes both a whole number part and a fraction part. 2 and 3 fifths, 5 and 1 fourth, and 7 and 4 fifths are examples of mixed numbers. An improper fraction is a fraction whose numerator is greater than its denominator. 3 halves is an example of an improper fraction. Here are 3 half pizzas. When two halves are put together, they make a whole pizza. Three halves of pizza is the same as one and one half pizzas. One and one half is a mixed number. The next time you eat a piece of pizza or a slice of pie, think of fractions. Consider how fractions represent a part of a whole or a part of a set, and remember that they can be compared, ordered, and simplified.